Good afternoon, Lace Jumpin. I'm John. This is many a true daughter. Welcome back to Fallout 4. Where last time we returned here to Concord, and uh, as a result of that, I have now got this magnificent cocky jacket. And today, yes, I'm turning my attention to the main plot of Sim Settlements, which is uh, the gunners. We may have slightly annoyed them by hacking into their radio systems by mistake. And that means we need to track them down to say I'm sorry, though, um, yes, I suspect it's not going to be that easy to talk the bastards down. Still, I will not deny, yeah, a bit of a journey eastwards might not be the worst thing in the world, because, uh, let's just say, yes, in the long run, I get the feeling I'm going to be needing a lot more settlements than what I've got right now. And there is one to the east of here I wouldn't mind picking up at some point, so... Uh, yeah, slowly making our way east and not a bad start. Okay, looks to me like, yes, number one would be just north of Olivia. So on the way, there is one thing I've been meaning to get to for some time. Here we go, Glitch Quarry. I will not say no while we're passing by. It's basically free XP. Now I've taken Aqua Boy. Remarkably simple mission, there is a quarry, it's currently flooded, Garrus Vicarian over here wants you to drain it by pushing three buttons. Life does not get more simple than this. Looking to earn some caps? I could use a hand here if you're all done gawking, you know. Honestly, I really wish he used the word calibrating, it would be much better if he did. And there we go, that should be at number three. A couple of Milocs are gonna get riled up by this, but that's fine. We've got Jake, we've got Garrus, I don't think it's going to be a huge problem. Right, just, you know, try and hit the Milok, you're going for him, aren't you? Right, this is, this is all fine. Go to the... Alright, well, he's been cocking eliminated. Hello there, I know there's one more, so don't worry, I'm sure Jake's got this. Yeah, seriously, Jake hits like a truck. And there we go, 50 caps, 200 odd XP, lovely. Okay, this is where stuff starts getting interesting, because yes, I'm now going north from a Glitch Quarry. I mean, somewhere around here is Tempine's Bluff, which I've not been to, because yes, in this particular universe, I was sent to, um, Oberland Station first instead. So, yeah, I may say a hi to them while we're passing by. And for the time being at least... Seems peaceful round here, okay. Right, now this, this is all added by the mod. There's nothing up here in the base game, so... Scavenger. Lights off. Okay. Were you wearing gunner gear, buddy? Was that like a gunner harness? Alright. Scavenger. Maybe not, maybe it's just a basic harness. Right, in which case, two are very nearby to each other, due east. Possibly, that's, what is it, Recon Bunker Theta. Bare minimum, should be, yeah, pretty quiet between me and there. Generally, there's not much right on the edge of the map, which is pretty much where we are. Ah, though, speaking of which, hang on, I think I know where we are. Small lit up house in this bit of the world next to, yeah, it's a large overpass. That's Outpost Zamonja. Just beyond that, isn't it? And yeah, there's a small house up on the high ground nearby to it. That'll be what that is. That would suggest that, yeah, I must be... Uh, I mean, pretty nearby to Tempine's Bluff. That's... Oh! You know what? I'll take a legendary blood bug while I'm literally passing by. Though, oh, hang on. How many are we talking? Here, you're a hatchling. Okay, just tag... You're coming in this direction, aren't you? Okay, please go away. Go away. Thank you. One instigating should take you out, though. That's going to... This is fine. Everything's fine. That's... We've missed them repeatedly, haven't we? Okay, this is... This is all a-okay. You've been hit. There we go. Jake finishes you off. And no, no, no. Oh, there's way more than I was expecting, but... Okay, everything's fine. Now it was, yes, the legendary, the one we disintegrated. In which case... No, it wasn't. Hang on, where was the legendary? Okay, I have found three corpses, all of them aside from the legendary. But what I have stumbled across is a brilliant encounter. Hi. Hey there. You look like someone who could use a dog. A man's best friend, right? 
I absolutely could, Garrus, alright? I would love a dog, so uh, yes indeed. I have got, I'm pretty sure, plenty of money right now. I will take your dog, sir. You've got a deal. Oh, yeah. You sure? I mean, she's a great dog, don't get me wrong. I just don't want to sell her to anyone who isn't going to take good care of her. I like that Gene is just really concerned in making sure he only sells the dog to responsible dog owners. And to reassure you that's true, would an irresponsible dog owner ever be dressed like this? I'll take good care of her. Don't worry. Yeah, okay. You look like you won't eat her or anything. So, you really want to buy her? I absolutely do. Send her along to the marina. Okay, girl. This is your uh, new owner. He's, he's going to give you a new home. Go on now. You you be a good girl. Bye bye. I uh I gotta go. You take care of her, all right? Gina really loves this dog. It's delightful. Okay, back to the gunners. Looks to me like we've got ourselves hang about. Broken down a house. Some sign of yeah. Slight adjustment post apocalypse. Just be careful. I've definitely seen mutants in this bit of the world before. Okay. If there is trouble here, I'm not seeing it right now. No sign of gunners here. It must be somewhere else. Okay. Nothing much here, so... Did I just hear... Distant gunfire off to the east. Possible? I'm not sure. Also cocking hilarious on my way back, I just found the legendary blood bug. I think it like rolled down the hill a bit and uh, okay, bolstering. Bolstering is not terrible, you know. Ah, but on the downside, just in terms of uh, yeah stats, I'd be giving up quite a lot of a uh, DR and energy resistance. So uh, as a result of that, yeah, it's leaded by the Luke's of it. Yep, lead lined and welded. It's just not that great. I think we'll just be, in fact, I was about to say selling it, but weight to value ratio is terrible too. You could just stay here, buddy. You're not coming with. Anyway, back on the high ground so we can see what you know going on and whatnot. Yeah. I think I know that shack. So just a mosey down, or we are nearby to Zamonja, but shouldn't be anywhere near close enough for, you know, the fat man armed gunner floating around there to consider firing on us, so... Alright, just... Oh! Nope, that's just pointing out the location. But yes, this is location number three, making me think, oh, hang on. This isn't in the base game. Yeah, it's those shanks up there. Those are base game. Right, now this looks more like it. Oh, hang on. We've got like a little cutscene or something. Oh my God. I know this place. I gave him A-Sams. What the hell happened here? That's close enough. Who are you? Whoa, easy there. Easy. We're not looking for trouble. Why don't you just put that gun down and we could talk? Why are you here? We're just looking for some gunners. That's all. Gunners? You with the gunners? Whoa, now, I said we're not looking for trouble. Slick, little help here? We've now suddenly got trouble. Am I allowed to, like, you know, maybe put on my fancy gear? Oh, I think I'm not. Like, I'm in, like, you know, a cutscene or something. Look, we're not gunners, and I'm not going to try an orange speech check when I'm not wearing my fancy gear. We're cool, all right? We just came to investigate. I think you've mistaken us for someone else. Yeah? So who are you? Look, friend, I'm Jake, and this here's my partner, and we're not with the gunners. So please, just put the gun away. You first. Okay, that's fair. See? Putting it away. All right. Assuming you're not gunners, why were you looking for them? We were hoping to discuss something with them. Huh. Well, I doubt you'll get much of a response, but if you want to strike up a conversation, go ahead. I believe that one was the leader. What happened here? Yeah, I'd like to know that myself. 
If you don't mind us asking, what went down here? And who are you? Gunner expansion. They tried to seize this place. Locals resisted. Maybe even fought back. You can see the results for yourself. By the time I arrived, it was too late to help anyone. So I found a concealed position on the overpass and administered a little wasteland retribution. You still haven't told us who you are, or what you're doing here. I'm Aiden, and without sounding too melodramatic, I hunt down gunners. Been on this squad's trail for a week. This is the fourth settlement they've hit. Okay, so if we're lucky, yes, the team that was going to come and kill us uh, has already been killed uh, by Aiden. So, uh, yes indeed. What's got you so riled up about them? Why? What's this all about? Gunners have been unusually active lately, laying claim to territory all over the Commonwealth. The settlement was just the latest conquest. Saying that, this place used to just be a solitary hut. I've no idea how they built up so damn fast. Sudden growth must have been what made them a target. Sudden growth? Oh no. Don't tell me the gun has attacked this place because I gave him ice, Sams. What? The hell are you talking about? They're these little sensor things. Help people build stuff. I've been providing them the settlements for months now. Huh. Then this attack was your fault. Hey! Now you just wait a minute. You better watch what you say, mister. Okay, Aiden, that's not cool and definitely not fair. Everybody just calm down for a second, okay? Calm down, both of you. Whether it was intentional or not, you made them a target. You can't blame me for what the gunners did. Folks deserve the opportunity to make a better life for themselves. And I don't appreciate some jumped up vigilante accusing me of... Whoa, whoa, wait, you don't need to... Hang on, what just happened? Reinforcements. Hope you can fight. Oh, we've got, we've got flipping bullets coming in. Okay, hang on. Get into cover, because I do not have... Uh, okay, hang on, what are we dealing with here? Basic gunners, you are in a bit of trouble, buddy. All right. And I see you, buddy. I'll take a 70%. That's a good hit. And uh, you're dead too. I think Aiden's doing good work. That'll be Jake firing in. Buddy, 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 buddy. Hold still. All right, it's over there somewhere. Just wait for him to pop up and... no. Nope! Gotcha. Got at least one killer, right? I contributed, and... Okay, there's definitely explosions going on over there. Do I have any other cover I could go to? Okay, more and more. There's 75, and that's you, nice and dead. And I see you there, buddy. Didn't get the hitting on you. He now knows where we are. Just stay here. We're right on the edge of the map here. I can't actually retreat that far because, uh, yes, that would be... Oh, blimey. Okay. Careful. Oh, okay. They can also shoot straight through this because it's like, you know, a shack or whatnot. So, okay, just be a bit careful. John, use the windows. And I cannot go that way again. It's going to be you nice and dead. That was a nice plasma weapon, wasn't it? Oh, there's actually... um. There's quite a few of them as it turns out. Okay, this is, this is, this is, this is fine. That's a tree. And uh, one more gunner. Down you go. Definitely more. Oh, blimey. Definitely more yet, though. Okay, that's fine. Tag him. So I know where he is. And uh, nice shots here. Yeah, you know what? This is a good little sniper balcony. But blimey, there are... Hang on, was that... Private. He's slightly a higher level. I don't really want trouble with you. This is not a bad location. Take a couple of shots here. They're focusing on me. Possibly at this point, Aiden is down. I don't know. Okay. Definitely. Okay, John. John, John, John. Do just a one stim pack for safety here. Just let them come a bit more in this direction while I get my McJibbles back. Right, that's you in a good position. That's you dead as well. Hopefully we're almost done here. And one shot for you too. Right. There's definitely one more enemy somewhere down over here. Just kind of stuck on a corner or something. You know what? That's a good one for explosives. So hang on. Just one a grenade down about. There should do it. And then just. All right. Bare minimum. It seems to have flushed you out. Do we have any more for any more? That's Jake getting the flank. Jake, this one is... No, seriously. Would you mind just, like, you know, coming out a bit, though? Oh, blimey. There might be more yet, though. This is... Hang on. Is that... No, that's Aiden. That's Aiden. Okay, fine. You know what? 
I'll come down and say hi. I don't want to, but bare minimum. Just, oh, this is. This is not a good gun for this, but, oh, this is, no. This is, this is not the right, this is not the right gun. This is not the right gun. Okay, hang on. Just, just go over to, like, you know, yes, the shotgun. Shotgun is fine. Hello over there. Don't you flipping mind. That's better. Lovely. Right, there's the private dumb. Aiden's fighting something in the distance. Go back over to, yes, my rifle. I can't go this way. I'm aware. Stay down. Whatever's out there. One legendary. If I could just get the shot on the head, I would probably take a, yeah, crit at this point. Don't see anything else dotted about. And, okay, there's at least one gunner private out there. This is not nothing. There's a lot cocky going on. Jake is uh, charging. He's back up on his feet. And, uh, see you, buddy. Do not have a great shot. That was lovely right there. Well done. Just a clip to the head. Uh, sticking out. There's the legendary. And one in the head means the crit gets the kill. Down you go, buddy. Nice. I am never going to find him in that bush. Are we done? Okay, we're back to hidden, but I'm a hearing a hang on. Jake is angry about something. Where is my last target? Whoever he is, he doesn't know where I am. Jake is firing at... Oh! I see you, buddy. That is... Oh, that did nothing. Okay. Maybe like, you know, something slightly longer range. 50-50 in the head. I'll take that. And... Come on, buddy. Just one more. Lovely. You handled yourselves well. Yeah, well, felt the need to blow off a little steam after someone accused me of causing what happened here. Not gonna let that go, are you? Say what you like about them, but the gunners run a tight operation. Sooner or later, they'll figure out what happened here. Chances are you and your partner will be flagged as persons of interest. Oh, great. That's precisely the kind of thing we came here to avoid. You can expect more gunner attention from now on, so watch your backs. And they'll give you even more trouble than they give me. Okay, so I'm guessing and now a talking to them is not gonna fly. It was always a bad idea, but it turns out to have been, yes, even worse than we thought. Is there a way I can communicate with them? You could try, but I wouldn't advise it. At this point, you put too many of them down. They're not gonna be interested in hearing your side of the story. Best thing would be to just lay low. Okay, and I'm guessing you've got your own fair share of gunner trouble. Can you tell me about your trouble with the gunners? Where would I even begin? We have history. That's all you need to know. Okay. I'm guessing we're going to be running into you again and we can learn more about your tragic backstory when we do. So what are you going to do now? I'm leaving. And so should you. There's no guarantee more reinforcements aren't en route. Yeah, well, nice meeting you. Yeah, whatever. Oh. And cut the charity with those sensors. They're just chum in the water. Okay. Right. Potentially, yeah. We shouldn't be giving these away to anybody aside from people who we're certain can actually, you know, uh, take care of themselves. Okay. Bare minimum. There should be some good loot to be had dotted about here. Stimpak's combat rifle. I'm pretty sure we don't actually have one of those so far. In fact, you know what? Check these corpses carefully. There's actually, yeah, good armor on gunners. This is a good way of just getting myself set up with some good, solid, basic stuff here. Like a lightweight reinforced combat armor. That's solid. i tell you what, though. Given this is like, you know, my first major engagement with the gunners, I'm taking their bandana off this corpse right here as a warning to the ones I run into in future. Okay, now time for everyone's second favourite game show. Where the cock is that legendary corpse? Because it was like... Somewhere over here. In some type of bush. But I don't know which one or where. So, uh, there's also so many cocky corpses dotted about. I have no idea where it would be. So, uh, oh, never mind. We got you pretty fast. And, uh, oh, I tell you what. Sprinters. You don't see sprinters very often, and almost nothing in this game is going to be better than bonus movement speeds. Also, I can't deny, if I'm going to be wearing, like, you know, an intimidating warning bandana, the skull bandana feels like it does the same thing, but better, because there's a skull on it. So we're taking that one instead. You think he's really gone? 
All right, so uh, yes, Jake, by the sounds of it, is uh, a bit concerned to buy this Aiden chap here. Yes, indeed. And it sounds like he got under your skin a bit, Jake. You're upset about something. I can tell. You heard what that guy said? That this was all my fault? You don't think he was right, do you? That given these people Ace Sam's made them a target? That I'm responsible for bringing the gunners here? Okay, yes, the fact they grew faster did to make them the target, but that does not make you in any way morally culpable for what the gunners did. You can't blame yourself. Yeah, maybe you're right. It's not like I can control what the gunners do. I'm just glad that Aiden fell is gone. There's something about that guy that rubbed me the wrong way. Maybe it was the gun that he pointed at my head. And I'm not sure I trust his version of events regarding what went down here. Okay, so... Yes, indeed. How about we just get out of here, like he was saying, in cases, you know, reinforcements or whatnot. Let's get out of here. Hey, um, I know this may seem odd, but I think I want to stay here for a while. We may have stopped these gunners coming to Concord, but in doing so, we might have dug ourselves into an even deeper pit. I need to think things over. Maybe come up with a new plan of action for us. Or at the very least, reevaluate how we're doing things now. Okay. Fair enough, you stay here, we'll catch up with you later. I'm guessing when he's ready to talk, he'll like, you know, send me a message on my pit boy as he's done before. Whatever you decide to do, I've got your back. I won't be here long. Come find me at the hardware store later. And stay safe out there, alright? If anything happened to you, well, just stay safe. Okay. We are literally right next to Zamonja. So as we've got, like, you know, uh, nice beds here and whatnot, and apparently I've just got a bit tired. There we go. Not tired anymore. Still got some uh, good daylight. And now I've got a good save down. Uh, let's see if uh, maybe I can... Uh, oh, I'm really gonna regret not having, uh, you know, uh, that crit in a hand in a moment, aren't I? Because with that crit in a hand, I probably could have taken out Captain Fat Man. But now... Uh, right... There's a fat man launcher right there. And he might be a little bit difficult to, you know, deal with. Stay in the shadows. Mosey on up here. Have a bit of a look see around you. Hang on. I think we've got him. Okay, that's you. That's you right there. That's fine. That's Boomer. The one who goes Boomer. Story checks out. I would say... I just picked up, yeah, a handful of extra frag grenades. Good start would be... Put them right there. In a row. All of them. One. Okay, number two. And there we go. And... This is why I only did this after dropping down the save. Actually, you know what? I don't think about this very often, but... I've got... A 43% chance of hitting the fusion core... If I were to get that shot, could I force you out of your power armor right now? Like, I very rarely bother with uh, fusion core hits, but... Okay, just... Good angle. Edge closer. We get this hit, and then we immediately just run. 60%. Alright. And now... Now we just cock and go. And... Never mind. Okay, on this occasion, they just sort of spotted me. So I'm just going to start basically putting huge amounts of, uh, yes, explosives. Uh, okay, so it turns out that was a much better plank. So I think they might be, hang on, are they, um, are they proper dead at this point? That's a scaver, not boomer. It's possible. Okay, so boomer's sort of standing next to me right now, but that's... Okay, that's... Oh, hang on, he's... He appears to not be getting out his fat man. He's decided to engage me in, um, you know, hand-to-hand -hand combat, which is... Well, you know what? That cocky works for me. And while we're mopping up the last handful, that should be just enough to get me into level 29. Beautiful. You know what? I just won that fight, in large part, because I just tossed explosives over and over again onto my enemies from above. 
So I really should take Demo Expert 3, damn it. Okay, if I want to keep going east at this point, then... You know what? I'm gonna head south and back down to Skylanes, uh, and then from there... We're returning to Molten. There's a couple of bits and pieces I wouldn't mind doing in that bit of the world. And it's a good launching off point if I decide I still want to be going further east. In fact, you know what, John? If you're going south anyway to get to, yeah, this area, play it safe. Alright, go to Covenant, rest up there, and maybe consider buying some more ammo. Because uh, I'm kind of desperately low on everything. Ah, uh, yes, and they've even got a doctor so I can get rid of my current psycho addiction. Okay, I've got 60 bullets here that I can really make use of. It's not like, you know, uh, great or anything, but it's better than nothing, alright? I'll take literally every shotgun show you've got to, which I will happily trade you for some drugs I don't need. Magnificent. Okay, bright new day, bright new ammo, no rads, no anything, and let's go have an adventure in Molden. And while I'm passing by, Abernathy did say clear out Taffington. At this point, I really feel like I should be able to. So, don't worry about the blood bugs. We can deal with blood bugs now. If we can, what is almost detecting me? Okay, that will be the blood bug. What managed to sneak up behind me? What a dick. Okay, everything's fine. Just, yeah. Take out the main one. That's a mine. There we go, Bunny. I see ya. Okay. To here. Sniper. That's a shot. And... Lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Now, there's more of them, but plenty of them are hatchlings. That was a complete mess. Okay. It's fine. It's absolutely fine. Alright, you guys are just hatchlings, right? Yes, you're just hatchlings. So that is all A-OK. -okay. The first shot's going to be a, a nice one here. And oh yeah, this is like no AP at all. Down you go. And number two. No, you cocky don't. Any more for any more. There's a blood bug way over there. Doesn't seem to be attacking me though. Okay. Definitely, yeah, you're like inside the house, but you're not really interested in hunting me or so. Okay. I don't trust that. There we go. I don't trust that mine being there. Sooner or later, that's going to screw me over. Okay, moseying nice and careful. Now, are you in the boathouse or are you in the house proper? Because, hang on. Where's the door to the boathouse? Because I kind of thought I could just get in round that way. But you're dead, bare minimum. More meat and... Oh, oh, oh. Don't like the noise. Do not like the level of noise. Okay. Crack you open in case you're inside, buddy. And... Okay. Can confirm. In the cooking house. And also, it will just be taking you down. Please, lovely. There's definitely... Uh, at least one more. Alright. Watch out for the traps and whatnot. Help myself to loads of lovely ammo. Right. There's one more. Don't know if I on him. In theory, he could be nasty. So just... Probably the one that was just upstairs, John. The one you saw a second ago. And... To the left. Pretty sure I can hear him. And... There you go! He completely dodged out of the way of that. Well done, but... Two short-range shotgun blasts. Idios of all. Lovely. And if we're in... Well, something else is around. Oh, hello! I did not see you up there. I mean, you know, that would have been a really good time for you to ambush me. But you didn't, you stupid loser. Just out of interest, yeah. How big is this place? So, okay. Some space at the front, and then it kind of doesn't really extend much out into the water at all. In fact, it basically doesn't. So, okay, no real pier potential. Maybe a small pier over here, but I don't see Taffington as part of, like, you know, my long-term strategy. It just doesn't feel like an exciting, sexy place to me. Instead, back on the road to, uh, yeah, Maldon. I've already cleared out Molten. It wasn't even that long ago. So nothing should be back there yet. 
Jeff from Molden. We're making good progress to the east. One thing I didn't get last time I was passing by, but I do want to grab on this occasion, which is... Uh, okay, the old sinkhole. Obviously, I'm aware. That means, you know, potentially uh, trouble and what's not, because, yeah, I see you down there. I see you there, buddy. But if we can just lure out Mr. Deathclaw before we go down into the sinkhole, there's only going to be so much he can do. Okay, that's a stingwing. That's that's not what we wanted. But, okay, just take you out there, lovely. Has that woken up Mr. Deathclaw? It might have done, but I'd rather wait for him to calm down a bit, you know. Make sure I get that sneak attack as well. Alright, buddy. Calm down, please. Calm down also. I'll take a crit on the belly. That was the sneak attack, which is lovely. Right, buddy. Buddy, 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 buddy. You can just stay down over there. You're probably going to... He's being tanked by Stingwings. Okay, well, all of a sudden, I'm kind of on the Stingwing side, at least for the minute, because, yes, he's going to clear them out for me. And then, in just a second, he'll probably start doing his, yes, weird rock-throwing animation. Okay. I'll take 50-50 on the arm, and if we're lucky... Okay. Down he goes, nice and easy. Honestly, that worked out perfectly. The reason we did that, though, wasn't just, you know, me showing off or anything. There is actually a very good reason to toss yourself into the sinkhole that gives this place its name. Here we go, just straight on in. And in just a second, we will load in underground. It really feels like a thing you shouldn't do. But it's a thing, actually, you should. Be aware, there's a handful of rad roaches down here. No trouble at all, please. No trouble at all. There's a mosey on up here because... Hang about. One of my favourite skill magazines, actually. Swimming 25% faster. As I say, movement speed. Never say no to movement speed. And we do have a couple of... Uh, yes. Oh, blimey, that was, that was, that was a mistake. Everything's fine. The bottle kind of uh, clipped against, um, yes, the uh, the thing, which it wasn't supposed to, to clip against. And my friends, the ghoul's still coming. Because they, they probably, they probably, they probably, they probably, they probably. Okay, this is, this is fine. Now I'm in danger. That's, that's okay. Where are the rest? If we're lucky, either their legs have fallen off. Or they've got bored and lost me. Molotovs. Always be careful with Molotovs. Because yes, the hitboxes could be a, a bit on the funky side. So everything's fine. It's all under control. Alright, you're nice and on fire. No trouble, buddy. No trouble. Just wait for the fire to go out. Okay, the other ones did not follow. But on this occasion, this should be a much better... I hit something. This is not what I'm meaning to hit. That's better. There we go. Where's the cooking glowing one? Got plenty of Molotovs. So this is fine. Still in caution. Hopefully, the glowing one doesn't have, like, you know, legs anymore. Okay, he does have legs, but he's also very, very badly wounded and appears to not be noticing where I am, which is just confusing, but also good news. So, okay. That's you all dead. Glowing ones. Never underestimate them. They can be a bit scary sometimes. If they get on top of you, that can be trouble. Okay, so my plan right now is basically jump from a safe location to safe location. Next up would be the slog. Oh, and speaking of friendly stuff en route, I had completely forgotten that Green Top Nursery was uh, literally right outside Molden. So, uh, okay, that's lovely. That's another good spot where, if need be, we can ask a vertebrate to land without having to worry about, you know, uh, enemies being around the area. Oh, and while I'm passing by, uh, right, Jake's done moping over the corpses he indirectly created. Uh, so, yes, whenever we're ready to, uh, we can mosey back over to Concord, though... Uh, Let's not worry about that for now. Instead, uh, stay focused, all right? Let's get the important stuff done. Like making drugs. Don't forget to make more drugs. Seriously, we need more drugs. Psycho Jet's amazing. Just keep moving east, all right? I'm determined to make it to my next dream city today. And here we go. We're in roughly the right spot because uh, there's the insane asylum. There's the river. The slog has got to be somewhere. In fact, you know what? That might be her right there. Okay, that's actually, yeah, closer to Green Top than I remember. Perfect. 
Okay, and from here I know precisely where I'm going. Straight over to the cannery. Because yes, I think I must have passed by the event where someone's got, you know, an upset stomach from eating the food from here. So, uh, right. Mosey in that direction. Eyes open. And yeah, stay away from the ironworks. No trouble with them today. Just look out for a death claw. I know one spawns around here. Okay, no sign of him, but we do have... Okay, you, sir, are a legendary radar. So, oh dear. No crit in hand. Right, okay, no, 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 no. You guys just stay right there, please. You're trying to heal, aren't you? None of that, never mind some of that. Right, just... He's definitely firing. Down you go. Right, just a random legendary raider. Really thought the sneak to the head uh, would take care of you, but then we are in a tougher level area right now. So, uh, assault rifle, not great. Exterminators, not great. Okay, let's move on. We should be almost there at this point. Though I'm going to be honest, the cannery was always just, you know, a, a location I was using to guide myself in the right direction. This obviously is not where I want to go. Where I really want to go is just up the road from it. The lighthouse. Now that, that's a settlement I want to set up, okay? Oh, hang the conk on. We've got, um... Right, super mutants just walked around the, um, the corner. Right, John. John, John, John. This here... This is why you do that whole making far too much Psychojet thing. Psychojet, it keeps you alive when otherwise you're going to die. They should put that on the packet, damn it. So, okay. Get out the shotgun. A shotgun under the effect of, yes, Psychojet is one, a hell of a thing. So I'm still in danger, suggesting there's going to be... Oh, there's so many. You're a skirmisher. You're a basic. Any more for any more. Okay, that puts me straight back into hidden. It's not super mutants in the lighthouse, is it? If you'd asked me, I would have said yes. Like, this was uh, Children of Atom. But giving it a scan... I don't see anything at all, actually. Hang on, who lives here? Because I do recall there are, like, loads of uh, mines around here, right? Here we go. Plasma mine. Yes, whoever lives here. They mine it up. So just tell myself to all the mines also traps. Okay. How much stuff to that? And also, John, you don't trigger mines anymore. That's a thing. You don't trigger. Maybe just take, like, you know, all the mines in case someone else triggers them down the line. Like, you know, it would be rude uh, to move people into my new settlement and there's still mines here that I don't set off, but I knew it was Children of Atom. Right. Here we go. One preacher and... Okay. Caution. Caution and coming this way. Walk away, buddy. Walk away. And in just a second. When you're nice and out of cover. There we go. 70%. And... That did far. Far less than I thought it was going to. I'm going to be honest, that was... That was okay. How many more are we talking? Because... Right, Psycho Jet. It's always a good time for Psycho Jets. Don't mind me. I'm nice and fast at this point. And no, no, don't you fire your gun. Still in danger. All right, who else do we have around here? I'm in danger from something. But I'm a hearing a hangabout. Get into the lighthouse. Close the doors behind me. Are they upstairs or are they here? Everything's going to be fine. Just use a psycho jet if need be. Is anyone up top? If not, we can lose. Ow! Bloody hell! It's fine. Everything's fine. He's just. He's, he keeps. There we go. Okay. Psycho jet. Why are you not just using psycho jet, John? Everything is a okay. And now, still in danger, everything's fine, apart from the fact I've lost most of my health meter. So, like, you know, rads, and also now more rads, everything is... It's it's all fine. Everything's fine. Just hide up here till they get bored. Here we go. I'd forgotten about you. Yes, there's like, you know, you up top here. So that's all absolutely 
fine. No, no, no. None of that, please. You need to go down. This is definitely like, you know, a, a crime as far as these guys are concerned. Just help myself to you. You're all nice and dead. You were feeding people to your god. Lovely. And just a few more on the way down. There we go. There's that addiction. And oh, dear. Okay. Just realized I'm kind of almost out of, you know, ammunition. They've definitely followed me upstairs at this point. Any more for any more. We're okay for now. Everything's fine, aside from the fact these guys are, you know, very much kicking my ass if I'm not under the effect of Psycho Jets. Okay. So I'm now stuck on top of the lighthouse, and uh, some of you are still alive. That's okay. Because, I oh, cock me, that's not enough for a kill. I see you right there. Come on, buddy, pop out and go! Nice, but now I'm back in danger. Okay, just go hide at the top of the lighthouse till they get bored. This is fine, all right? We can just fish in a barrel, these guys, step by step. And hello, sexy. So now, buddy, 50-50. See if we get lucky there, and... Down he goes. Hidden. And to level up to. I think I just leveled up from securing this here lighthouse. Beautiful. Okay, this level though, right. Better crits. Never gonna say no to that. Get that in my rotation, please. Thank you. And just to confirm. Gosh darn it, somebody's still alive somewhere. Who the cock is still alive? There we go, there's someone on the boat who just sort of didn't get the memo. They're like, you know, all her friends were dead. Okay, how about now, you fussy, cocky, pleb settlement and... Oh, yeah. Oh, flippin' yeah. Now this. This, I think, is rather exciting because... Uh, right, let's go over what is and isn't inside this place because... Uh, right, we've got ourselves uh, water. Maybe not like, you know, as much water as I was hoping for. But we do have uh, this lovely sticky outy pier. Some more like, you know, uh, piers down there. Bit of beach and whatnot. Water in general means, yeah, you can use uh, the big water purification systems, uh, which is nice. So, uh, yeah, just keep going in this direction. The boat's a bit in the way, but I feel like, you know, there's some really cool stuff you could do uh, with the boat, with this pier right here. Oh, yeah. This here. This could be interesting. What it does have uh, is a vertical height. Because, you know, uh, you've got the flipping lighthouse right here. I mean, in theory, I know you can build off the lighthouse. Once upon a time, many years ago, I did a build video showing you how to build your own airship off the lighthouse. So, uh, you know, Sky City right by the ocean, a personal challenge to the stupid Brotherhood of Steel and their stupid Pritwin right over there. Okay, you know what? This, I like. So, okay, having made it here, how about we call it a part there? Because next time, I think we need to go and check back in with Jake. And sooner or later, we need to nip back down to the marina to check in on how those guys are getting on. So, uh, hopefully, you join me next week for that. But in the meantime, I've been John. This has been Many a True Nerd. And this has been Fallout 4. Thank you very much, and goodbye. Ah, we have got a gate key here, and then we have got a... I've made a mistake, I've made a mistake, I've made a mistake, I've made a mistake! This is going to take all of my skill and cunning as a hunter to sort out... Die, you moving bastards! Die! Die! Go, go away. Go away, nobody likes you. That was a good idea till it wasn't.